Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. We have a, another Trunks figure here on the channel. I think we've done three so far. We did Future Trunks from Cell Saga. We did a Super Saiyan Trunks, also from the Cell Game Saga. And I think we did the Energy Blaster one. So I believe this is number four, um, as far as trunk figures go, Trunks figures go. This one was requested by several subscribers. So I hope you do enjoy this one. Uh, we can see the sword has come just a little bit loose. That's no big deal. We'll get it out of the package here in just a minute. But just to kind of go over it beforehand, we've got original cast, trunk saga, future trunks. We've got our figure here. And on the back, we've got some of the other figures from the set. So we'll be opening this one. Now we've got Krillin, Dende, King Kai with Bubbles, and Chi Chi. I'm looking at getting the Krillin. I've seen Dende around. I haven't seen King Kai or Chi Chi, but uh, if we can collect all of them, we definitely will. So let's go ahead and get this guy out of the figure. Let's see just how cool it's going to be. I've wanted this one for a long time, and it just takes me right back to watching this. Um, Tsunami, and I think we all remember when Trunks first showed up. He defeated Frieza and King Fold, and I just thought he was the coolest character. None of us knew anything about him, and then that next episode, he told us who he was and why he was there, and it set up the whole Android saga. So every time I see this figure, especially in this classic outfit, it just takes me right back to that. Let's go ahead and get him up close here, so you guys can see. So he's got his kind of classic outfit, the one he was introduced in. The purple jacket, Capsule Corp logo, that's a nice touch. You can see his hair there on the side. You can see they did a good job with his face. He's kind of got that angry smirk, bright blue eyes. The hair was done perfectly. You can see the strap going across here to hold his sword. He's got the jacket, black shirt underneath. Good detail there on the belt. Um, his arms move up and down and they also come out to the side. And then here to up and down and come out to the side. It does not bend at the elbow. And then we can put the sword in his hand here. Um, his legs do come up. And they bend at the knee. And then here as well, it comes up, bends at the knee. And here's the back of the figure. They did a really good job on this. The bright color on the sheath. Or, see the bright yellow on the boots. Nice brown detailing. And then we got a sword. Let me just see if the sword will actually sit back here. And I think it will. You've got to kind of push it around his hair, but that's cool. I was not actually expecting that, but that's such a nice touch. You got trunks. You can see the handle right here. That's unbelievable. I already love it. Got probably one of my favorite figures now. I've got to get him. Um, the Super Saiyan version. I've seen several like this. They've got the one where he's got the jacket on. Then they've got the one where he doesn't have the jacket. It's just the black shirt and he's in Super Saiyan. Looks incredible. Um, I think it's one of the kind of like kicking action or punching action figures. It comes with a board or a table or something they can shatter. Um, hoping to get that one sometime soon and just kind of continue the trunks. Kind of a trunk series. So definitely one of my favorite characters. And from the feedback I get in the comments, seems like a lot of people enjoy seeing this figure as well. So his wrists don't rotate, but the sword should fit in there. Yeah, that's a perfect fit. And the blade's a little bent here at the top. I think we just kind of put that back. It's been in the packaging for so long and can't expect it to be perfect, but again, that's no biggie. So it looks great here with the sword in his hand. I always think of when he's going to attack um, Android 18, when Vegeta's losing the battle, he kind of comes in with the sword. Now he's Super Saiyan then, uh, but he comes in with the sword, breaks off 18's arm, and then Android 17 takes care of him pretty quickly. So I do like the sword in his hand, but I think I'm going to put it back here and then bring the camera down so we can see the figure up close. Good job here on the sword too, the handle, all the detailing. Incredible figure, absolutely incredible. So one second, let me move the plastic packaging piece out of the way. And then we'll bring the camera down. And then let's take a look at trunks up close. No, oh, I love it. 
I cannot wait to get this in the Super Saiyan version. And hopefully, I've seen one where he's got that on his back. Hopefully, this sword will fit there too, so we can get him as a Super Saiyan with the sword, um, with the sword and the sheath. That would just look incredible. So there it is from the front. There's that Capsule Corp logo on his sleeve. Really nice touch. I love that they actually did that. And then there's the figure from the back. Again, bright yellow color with the blue straps. Looks incredible. So thank you so much for tuning into this video. I hope you enjoy this Trunks figure. And then tune in next time too. And we will have our first Yu Yu Hakusho figure. And it will be Hiei. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.